kan? Firstly, we turn on this to 32 ampere. Okay, and then we turn on the dryer. Okay, so and then we on the air, just like that. See, the airflow will be cut off. And then next, we we'll, uh, do the operation on the KCP. So we pass to the uh, to power on the hookup panel. We just need to switch on the button. Okay, so after turning off the controller and the computer, we will now turn off the air supply and also the power supply. So to turn off the air supply, we turn off the air dryer, we turn off the air pressure supply, and then we turn off the power supply. After this, we have to, as a safety precaution, we have to um, disengage the actuator over here by knocking it very hard. Refer to 
to the function on the right hand side of the monitor. Okay. Uh, this is the speed of the machine. This is the base base axis coordinate. This is the speed of the machine. This is the up, up and down. And this is the mouse of the Toka control panel. And the behind is the enab enabling switch. Alright, so now I will explain about how to use the mouse to control the robot over there. Okay. So first of all, you need to um, change this configuration from this from this configura configuration is you cannot move the robot using this and also this the mouse. So in order to use the mouse, you need to press this button, and you can see a mouse over here. So with this icon here, you can use the mouse to control the robot. Okay. So before we can use the mouse, we have to press one of the three enabling switches over here this one this one or this one okay so now i'm pressing this one so after pressing the enabling switch you can take note that the eye over here has become green if i release the button it becomes red so i press once it becomes green i can use the mouse to control the robot. Okay, so I'll be using the mouse to move the robot now. So first of all, we're moving the, mo uh, the robot in this direction. Okay, the reverse of the previous direction. This is the another axis. This one, the reverse of the previous axis. You can also pull it. Also push it. So this is the three uh, uh, transitional direction. So now I'll be rotating the robot in this direction. The reverse of the previous direction. Also I can turn uh, rotate this in this axis. Also in reverse of the previous axis. Also the last axis. Like this. So this is how we control the robot using the mouse in all six axes. After we have learned on how to operate this robot using the space mouse, we are, I will show you how to operate this robot by using the uh, button provided in the KCP uh, using the base coordinate. Okay, first, uh, I will show you on how to move along the X axis. Press the button if you want to move forward. And then if you want to do the reverse direction, you pull the minus button. If you want to move along the Y axis, press the plus button, you move on the right and then we will do the same the reverse direction that exactly as this same too we will move up if you want to move down and then you press the minus button if you want to do the do rotation along the X just press the and then the reverse of the rotation and then in another Y rotation then you want to reverse it and the last one is C and the reverse of this direction okay, thank you okay, so press the select from the select and, and it comes to our program so to run the program you need to press this white and green button. So first we press the white button. This eye will turn green. 